Welcome to our Walled Garden online tutorial. This video shows you how to update your own information. From the home page, click on the cogwheels symbol in the top right hand corner beside your name. This will take you to your user settings. The cogwheels symbol is always visible throughout the site. In user settings, you will then be presented with three options in the left hand navigation panel. They are your profile, security, and help. First, the Your Profile tab. At the top of the page, your name, centre number and customer ID will be displayed. Your details include your first name, last name, job title, telephone number and email address. These fields are editable by you and a red asterisk denotes mandatory fields. If you make any changes, you must click the green Save Changes button in the bottom right-hand corner. If you click the grey Cancel button, no changes will be saved. For centres that work with City and Guilds, you can choose to receive email notifications which will sign you up to our centre preferences and let you stay up to date with qualifications and products. You can sign up for these from here. In the Security tab, you can change your password. To do this, enter your current password, followed by the new password twice, to confirm. Please note, your password must be alphanumerical, with a minimum of 6 and a maximum of 8 characters in length, and is case sensitive. It must also be different to your previous 5 passwords. Your password cannot begin with an exclamation mark or a question mark, or with the same two characters. Click the green Save Changes button to apply changes, or cancel to return and no changes will be saved. In the Help section, there are a few options. If you are a main centre, you'll have the option to select your sub-centre to view relevant information for that centre. If there are no sub-centres attached to your account, then you will only see your main centre's ID. Here you will find the contact details for your centre's primary user or users. Note that the primary user is the main contact for your centre. They are responsible for the creation of additional centre users and viewing or amending those details. This will typically be an exams officer. In the Customer Services section, if you work with both ILM and City and Guilds, you can select either organisation to view contact details for the relevant customer services or business manager contact. The Contact Us button will take you to the relevant website for further contact details. The grey Cancel button will take you out of this section and will not save any changes you have made. We hope that you have found this tutorial useful. Check out our online resource hub for further information.